Welcome Welcome back to... F it. Screw it. You know what? Fine. F it Friday. Welcome back to F it Friday. So, it's been a while since we've played Skyrim. And I know we said next week we'd play Skyrim. And by next week, I mean like a month and a half later. But for all of you, it will be like it was next week. Maybe. Well, Sometime. It depends. Well, if you're watching these out of order... Well, okay. If you're watching it like Skyrim order... Sure. Because you're in the far future. Yeah. But if you're keeping up with us, it's like a month and a half later. Okay. Yeah. Unless you want to, like, go back, watch that first episode, and wait a week and come back. Yeah. That seems a little uh, convoluted, but you could. Yeah. So, I leveled up off screen. Yeah, we uh, we did some stuff off screen because that character killed us in one shot last time. Yeah. So now Nappa Jr. Jr. is uh, a bit tougher. I don't know why he's named Nappa Jr. Jr. Because that's what we named him? I, I'm aware of that. I don't remember our reasoning behind Nappa Jr. Jr. Oh, um... Because Goku Jr.? Right. And we were like, that's just silly. <laughs> like, maybe he was named after... Nappa Jr., so it'd be Nappa Jr. Jr. Okay. So, anyways, while I was leveling up, I got us some new uh, new powers from these mods. What uh, new insane shenanigans did you give us? Well, so the first one is this. Yeah. Zap, zap. Oh, that is holy Dragon Ball Z. Yeah, so that's, uh, that's one kind of Chidori. Oh, that's Chidori? Yeah. That's a weird-looking Chidori. What happens if you do it at the same time? Uh, this is a different one. Oh. Uh, nope. There we go. What is that one? Okay. Because, you know, when you need to, uh, when you need to do that, I think we've seen this one before. Yeah, we saw that one. Uh, it doesn't really seem to be doing anything to him. I like this one, though. Oh, that one's cool. Yeah. I like that one a lot. Yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. And then Fireball and... Rasengan's just you go up and punch him, really. Oh, okay. And we don't really want to do that. I also I got uh, I made Darth Revan's lightsaber. Oh, okay. So it's it's pretty snazzy. All right. Yeah. So the only thing I would change is the color of the lightsaber. Yeah. What What are you thinking? I don't feel Napa Junior Junior would be red. Okay. I'm not quite sure what color, but I, it just doesn't seem red suits him very much. Sure, I get that. Although. If this was Dragon Ball Z, Nappa Jr. Jr. would probably be red. Mm -hmm. But it's DBZ. If we're like basing this off DBZ abridged Nappa Jr. Jr., sure. Then that would be something else. Wow, he is not taking hits. Yeah, no. Uh, yeah, so despite leveling up and, you know, getting pretty tough gear, I like to think. Yeah. Oh. Uh, these guys still prove to be. Um, uh, pretty tough. Is there well, anything you can do to, like, is there any other magic we can do to just kill him? Uh, well, we have, <laughs> we have one thing. Okay, what we'll, is uh, the one thing? <laughs> it's, uh, <laughs> so it's a, it's a bleach thing. Um, you know, I think, uh. Okay. This... I've, okay, so I've been trying to keep up with bleach. Sure. I'm on, like, episode 172. So you're not going to know what this is yet. No. You know how I feel about bleach spoilers. Mm -hmm. Well, I there's could... no other way, is there? Uh, you saw how much damage I did. None. Uh, it would take about uh, you know, five years, is my rough estimate to kill him. Okay. All right, viewers, you better know how special you are because I hate bleach spoilers with a passion, mm -hmm. and it looks like something's about to get spoiled. So, all right, let's do this. Uh, nope, that's not the button. This is the button. Whoa. Just wait. Okay. What? What's with the demon horns and the long hair? Ah, stupid Fusrida. Wow. What is that? Uh, you know, it's it's a thing. You'll uh, you'll eventually understand. It's, it's orange hair. Yeah. Ah, that's Ichigo, isn't it? Maybe. Oh God. I really need to catch up on that. And we got him. With full health. Wow, you almost had, like, no damage. So you get massive health regeneration and stuff? Yeah. The only problem is now our energy's gone, and now that it's, like, says we have no more energy, it's pretty quickly gonna dump us out of this mode. Oh, okay. So that's the, the downside to it. Yeah. 
But hey, I mean, you kill it with a lightsaber. Yep. While in Ichigo form. So that's pretty exciting. That's pretty exciting. <laughs> there was nothing in there, was there? Oh. Oh, there he goes. And it, now Nappa Jr. Jr. is like his granddad's battle with Goku. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that's what happens. That's that's the one, you know, after effect of that. Alright. You know what we should do? Okay. We should find a Saiyan armor mod. That would be pretty cool. You know, I actually haven't specifically looked for one of those. Yeah. But I bet there's one out there. So, alright. So I haven't played Skyrim in yeah. many, many years. Yeah. Uh... Last time I played was probably 2013. Okay. So, you know, a whole year and a half. Sure. Um, and I haven't played on PC since longer than that. Okay. With my mods. Sure. Which, I'll be honest, we're all aesthetic. Who's that? It's a uh, chronographer. I don't remember uh, us seeing him before. You know, it, it happens. Spaceships and stuff. This was a part of the loving, wasn't it? Uh, you know, I'm I'm not gonna lie. I yeah. don't remember him being there either. Okay. Uh, it's possible he fell through the roof. What? Or the floor at uh, mods? Uh, so sometimes when <laughs> things, uh, I mean, it's probably just there was some weird collision or something. Okay, yeah, that, um, that happens a lot. But I like to imagine that it's since this whole ship or this is like a base that's all about sending things through like wormholes and space travel and stuff yeah weird portals and stuff you know it just appears sometimes people get thrown around okay i can dig it yeah that's special uh <laughs> so do we want to keep going through more of this or do we want to go do something else well we didn't really explore a whole ton of this mod correct so i like the whole verse is going through this mod with the spaceships so okay. i think we should go until like we see some spaceships Alright, you want to go for the spaceship? I want to go for spaceship. Spaceship's this way. I all need right. to kill this guy first, though. Okay. Because there's some levers in this room. Do you uh, need to go all Ichigo? Yeah. Yeah, because otherwise... Uh, He's going to just We saw what happened his... last time. Yeah, Yeah, get him, Ichigo. Yeah! Ah! Uh, Fuzroda. Yeah. It's so weird to see a giant robot with Fuzroda. Yeah, no, it's, it's, pretty, it's pretty strange. There we go. Get him. You're gonna get him. Yeah, but as you... So, in this mod, the, this transformation that I have currently... Yeah. Uh, there's multiple levels to it. This is like the second from the bottom level. Oh. So, each one has higher, like, mana cost. Yeah. And higher mana sustain okay. cost. So... So what you're saying is we need to upgrade our mana like crazy. Right. So what I'm saying is eventually... Uh, it's possible... For our mana to eventually be so powerful um, that we're able to cast the bigger forms. Yeah. And when we cast the bigger forms, we get even bigger bonuses. Oh. Like, at the moment, this bonus is so massive, like, we can comfortably take out those guys without any effort. Yeah. Um, but without that, we'd, uh... <laughs> We would not be able to take them at level 12. No. Thankfully, we have that, though. Yeah. How's that lockpicking working out for you? Well, so there's a lever behind this uh, this door. Yeah. Which is important because it opens a door that makes it much easier to get closer to the spaceships. Yeah, but it's a lock level expert. Yes. So somewhere around here is... Uh, uh, a way to get through this. Yeah. I can't... It says you only have three lockpicks left. Or it could be 33. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's the, the screen... Uh, yeah, cutting it off. Yep. Alright. Huh. Um, I'm pretty sure it was straight up and like a little to the left. Yeah. Oh. That was very close. Yep. Lockpicking in Skyrim is kind of my thing. <laughs> all right. <laughs> that's cool. Like, my Khajiit character is all about sneaking. Like, that's yeah. all I ever did was... you. It is so amazing to go through a dungeon 
and steal everything and kill people mm-hmm. without anyone in the world knowing. Mm. I see that. Yeah. That's pretty cool. It was fun. Ooh, gun. Yeah. We already have one, but... You could sell it. Yeah, it's true. And introduce guns to Skyrim. Because that's what they need. Oh, I mean, give it to, like, the Stormcloaks. Okay. Uh, well, why not? Just give the gun to the Stormcloaks and just watch them, you know, just wreck shop against the uh, the Imperials. Or give it to the Imperials Yes. and watch them put down the dogs of the Rebellion. <laughs> 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 just, uh, you know, throwing just that out there. there. Yep. Uh-huh. That makes me kind of want to build uh, a Star Wars campaign. Okay. From the Imperials' perspective. Sure. And just put down the rebel dogs. Whoa, he's green. Yeah, he is. Huh. Uh. So you're going to do the Ichigo thing? Yep. Yeah, pretty much, uh, I'm pretty hey. much going to be using that in every fight. Okay. And they're going to use that in every fight. Yeah. Pretty All much. Right. All right. I yeah. don't blame them. I mean, you see this devil thing running at you. Yeah. Ah, dang it. No, please not in the hole. Okay, good. Oh, God. There's, there's a hole yeah, right there's above a, I, lava. I saw that. When we uh, walked through this room, there was a Oh, no, hole. we're almost out of energy. I hope we have this form. Gosh dang it! Long <laughs> enough to kill the guy before we uh, I don't know. You may have out. to run for it. Maybe. I uh, mean, oh, okay, we oh, got it. Oh, you just barely got it. And there it ran out. <laughs> Whew. Oh wow, Vasta Lorde. Yeah, it's a uh, it's a term in uh, Bleach for a uh, uh, thing. No, I, I've come across that name a couple times. Oh yeah, yeah, but yeah. it was not related to Ichigo whatsoever. Mm. That's interesting. <laughs> uh, I really need to catch up some more. Yeah, yeah, you do. <laughs> oh, that's. Also, this this introduces some uh, platforming, platforming challenges, which is your bread and butter. Yeah, huh. uh, yeah. So that one's a pretty easy one. There's later one where you have to do like crazy jumps. Yeah. Um, while those things are happening. Oh. And that's pretty rough. Faster, Lorde. Eh? Yeah. Kill him. See, I think it would help not hit get hit by food at all if you go around them. Oh, okay. That might that might work. Yeah, I could try that. So, recently we just did a recording. It may be out. I think it's out from this. Sure. Or at least the first episode. Okay. I don't know. I don't know if I should spoil it or not. Okay. But one thing we get from it is, you know, being clever rather than just bullheaded. Sure. So, you know, instead of just, like, tackling it head on, maybe, like, skirt around it, use some different tactics. Hmm. That's interesting. Uh, so, when I've played through this without deciding to use just... W- when I play a, like a more finesse character in this game... Yeah. And I'm doing this quest... Yeah. Um, what I do is I typically oh, play... Oh, he's gonna murder you. Yeah, he is. And now we're out of... Uh, yeah. Ugh. I would say run, but you're out of uh, <laughs> yeah <laughs> everything. Mm. Well, I don't mean like not doing it because you don't have a finesse character... But, I mean, when you're fighting someone with a sword and you don't sure. just charge straight at them unless you want killed. <laughs> See, this, this is the any, problem. Do you have any potions or anything? Yeah. The problem is he hit me twice. Oh. And now this happened. Alright, we need we need more energy now. Magicka. And stamina? Alright, we're about to activate this form. Again. Here we go. There we go. Alright, now we can take him. There we go. Take him on. Hmm. So, normally what I do when I come through here yeah. is I play, like, a ranged character. Oh, okay. Um, and so I tend to try more sneaky things, right? Yeah. Um, or maybe I'll use magic to try to uh, find ways to get them to fight each other or something. That would be awesome to watch. Um, by using, like, summons and stuff and then uh, using other, like, illusions and things. Yeah. Um, so now we're looking for a key. Right. Uh, no, the things that are keys are normally activated by levers. Oh, okay. So those levers I've been pulling have been opening doors. the doors. Got it, and we haven't found the lever for this one. Uh, right. I think there might be a lever around here. Okay. Is it in here? No, it doesn't look like it. 
One of these places has a lever or a treasure chest. Okay. That might There's have something important. Chest. Um. Hide minor illusion. I mean, I that's, that's it's, all. It's all, all that's, good. All that's worth taking. Yeah. Absolutely. Like, there's quite literally no reason not to take it. <laughs> yeah. I mean, unless we were over-encumbered. Mm. Which happened to me a ton. Yeah. Um, so one thing we mentioned Ooh. last time. Oh, right. This is... So one of the things is we haven't really gone into all the, the lore and the different packages and stuff and papers. No, we were going to do, like, a dramatic reading of them, but we never got to it. Yeah, so one of the things you read when you read through this stuff in this room is this is their last stand. So, like, there's their gun oh, and their the body. gun and they're they, set it up. Yeah, this is what they did when they held themselves off in here. Against what? Uh, these things. Oh. So, these are designed to... So, these guys aren't the first people here. Okay. They're not even the first people to use this technology. Oh. And so, it's this other group, that these things that have been here for so long. Um, so, these guys are more... They're not exactly scavengers. Yeah. But, they definitely... They're newer to it than the originals. Oh, okay. Um, the people who created all this. Yeah. And so, because of that... It's weird that all their stuff is empty. Yeah, they, they don't have anything on them. Yeah, but except, like, a really sweet mask. Yeah, no, it's a, it's a spaceship helmet. Yeah. Yeah. I want it. Yeah, it's it's pretty cool. But yeah, so you can see how they barricaded themselves in here. Yeah. And this is, this is one of the platforming areas. Alright, that doesn't look too difficult, just... Jump over there yep. and jump down. Just don't get pushed. Correct. And if you do land in the lava, you will die. Well, yeah, it's lava. Yeah. Just thought it would. Just thought it would. Mention I mean, that. Dust knows all about that. Mm. Okay. How do I get down from here? Uh, uh, I, need I to... would suggest. So, yep, right there is a little platform. I'm just jumping down. <laughs> no, nope. not, not exactly <laughs> no, where no, I'm no. jumping down. I died. I tried to land on the platform, but I missed. Yes, you did. How far back did it put us? Probably put us back pretty far, I'm afraid. Oh, this I don't is know. This, this is sounds horrible. Yeah. I mean, the thing's not there, so we. Okay. Well, we killed it. So yeah, no, that's All fine. Right. Yeah, that's 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 acceptable. Yeah, I can live with this. Yeah. Just every time before we do a platforming thing, or we, right after a platforming thing, uh, we can save it. We should save. Yeah. But you have a lightsaber. I mean, you could just. Cut them down. <laughs> Shh, no, no. Shh, no. No, that'd be too easy. Shh, no. Okay. <laughs> For half a second, I thought you hit him so hard mm -hmm. that he was gonna fly away. No. Oh, we should. Yeah, I think after we do this quest, we should okay. do like the dragon quest. Ah. Right, yeah, because I, I have not done anything. Like, the dragons haven't even started to spawn yet. Yeah, we, we should, like, get some uh, some things. Doesn't running use up your stamina? Yes. Which will make it uh, go away? Yeah. Mm. Dang it. See, that wasn't very smart. Oh, you could just, like, pop some stamina potions. Uh, I suppose I could. Oh, no, no. never mind. Bad time, bad time. Magic potions? Yep. Magica. And some stamina. Oh, no, because when you used it last time, you had a bunch more stamina. Correct. Because Regen... Yeah. Take it all. Uh, oh. Yeah, that's, well, that's the one problem. Yeah, that... I kind of, like, don't like them having Fusrada. Yeah. Like, I know there are other enemies in the game that have it. Yeah, but, I mean, they're Dragar. Yeah, but in all honesty, I didn't like them having it either. No. It's I, just, like, annoying... It, it's annoying, it detracts from the game. Yeah. I, I don't think it's very clever either. Pretty much. And it just doesn't make sense, like, lore-wise, why a robot would have it. Like, I could see maybe having, like, a compressor. Yeah, I think that that's the explanation. Is there oh, okay. creating, like, Ethereum uh, energy fields? Oh, okay. Yeah, but, I don't know. Giving them Fusrodaw is kind of... I don't like it. No, I, I understand that. Yeah, you might want to put on your clothes. Yep, time to time to get that back. Yeah. Du, 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 du. All right, now here we should save. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. The Aria Wars. Yeah. So even though a lot of these books may say uh, they have the same name. Yeah. 
Um, they will have... Different words. Yeah, different content. Yeah. All right. Although that would make it really hard to organize in your inventory. Absolutely. That's the <laughs> one, like, that's a complaint I have about this mod is Let's like... save here. Okay. <laughs> right, that's not save. No. Uh, save. So, just so you guys know, we're using... I'm, I'm having Monkey use an Xbox One controller mm -hmm. for this, which he's not totally entirely used to. Which just makes me giggle on the inside. <laughs> but I wanted to do this because I've always wanted to try it, and I don't have a PC. So. Sure. I thought it'd be fun. Plus, it's Friday, so. Screw it. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> That'd be a shame if he forced you onto lava. Oh, no, that's happened to me so <laughs> many times. So many times. And that's why we saved it. It's a, it's a real pain. See, that's why you just, like, duke around him. See, like, well, if you go onto, like, the sides. Yeah. Then it's all right. Yeah. Because then you just get knocked into a wall instead of to lava. <laughs> and so you can just, like, walk down. Yeah, you're fine. All right. Maybe. Yeah, platforming in Skyrim is, like, it's a little tricky because it's not natural. Yeah. But it's not hard. It's not hard yet. Okay, well, I mean, Skyrim platforming in general. Okay. The thing that makes it hard is just it's not natural for Skyrim. Sure. Yeah, I get that. Um, I think we're going the right way. All right, we're going deeper into the mm -hmm. into the mod. Yeah. I mean, the quests. <laughs> same thing. You mean the spaceship area? Yeah. We're getting closer to the landing bay. Yep. I'm excited to get to that. Uh, we do have to kill a boss or two in order to get all of the parts we need. Okay. Like the, uh, I think... Why does Ichigo have a hole in his chest? Uh, so I've been deliberately trying to not uh, mention... Uh, <laughs> so, you know, it's a spoiler for you, so... So let's not. I, I didn't, right. didn't want to... Right. I mean, I, I could tell you. I'd rather you not. <laughs> I mean, it. it's something I hypothesized when I saw... Number four? Okay. Uh, yeah. The guy with the green hair and the green eyes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, when he punched Ichigo in the same spot his hole is, mm -hmm. and then suddenly you never see his chest again. Okay. I kind of... I have some theories about that. Sure. But... Wow, I got a lot of keys. Those are big keys. Yeah. So we have the first and second key. I don't remember if we need a third... I don't know. Although, if this was Nintendo, you would need a third. Correct. Uh, pretty much without fail, Nintendo would make us have a third. Oh, yeah. I mean, third's a good number. Yeah. Like, it's uh, it's not too many, it's not too few. Is this just the storeroom? Whoa. Uh, this might just be the storeroom. Yeah. But, okay. I mean, there's nothing wrong with... Oh, yeah, no, for sure. There's like, some really cool things gold here. Golden lockpicks. Yeah. Do you take everything? Um... You know, for the sake of this video, I haven't been, like, my normal habit is to take everything. Okay. And, like, everything ever, particularly because in this mod pack, yeah, um, I have a thing equipped, one mod on, called the Bandolier mod. Yeah. Which ends up oh, allowing yeah, you to... Oh, yeah, which, like, tons of pockets that we saw in the first video. Yeah, it basically gives yeah. you an extra, like, three to four hundred encumbrance. Well, you know what? Uh-huh. Screw it. It's Friday. Sure. Play how you would. Okay. Just, you know, with slight guidance from me of, hey, we should see that. <laughs> sure, sure, right. No, I get that. What's up, guy? Hey, buddy. I like the hammer. I just noticed the hammer and axe on his hands. As oh, yeah. Hands. yeah. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, no, it's it's pretty cool. So, I've talked before about playing D&D &D and having that game. Mm -hmm. This makes me want to use, like that for the dwarf sentries instead of having like dwarves guard things just having those up there with the hammer and axe hands yeah like giant giant robot things oh yeah i'm i'm all for giant robot things where do you I, go buddy there i like are. giant robots which is why i'm pretty excited for your uh your D, D star wars zelda game yeah because you know like like you do yeah i think it's gonna be a good time oh yeah like power armor with like Zoras and everything. Mm-hmm. I'm hoping to be a, 
A Twilight Eldritch Knight. Which is, uh, it's pretty cool. Heck yeah. Do you want to explain, uh, explain what that is to... Alright, so I'm not around. entirely sure where Twilight is. Okay. I know it's a thing from Zelda Twilight Princess. Mm-hmm. Uh, I know it's a race of somethings. Okay. That's about as much as I know from them. <laughs> All right. It's whatever Minna was. Yes. And what she transformed into. Correct. I'm not really. Sh I'm not sure if they're from another dimension. Okay. Or from another timeline. Okay. Because Zelda has timelines which it shouldn't. But yeah. That's another video. Um. And then Eldritch Knight is for D and D Fifth Edition. Uh, they kind of rewrote the entire game. Which is what they do for some editions, but not others. Mm -hmm. And they went back. They basically have the perfect feel of AD&D and 4th edition. Okay. Uh, for those of you who don't know what that is, I ain't got a year to explain it. <laughs> um, <laughs> but it's a lot more free-flowing. It's a lot more... It's more about the flavor than just the hardcore rules. Mm-hmm. Uh, often it'll be like, you know what, these are just guidelines. You do whatever you feel like doing for the rules. Okay. And an Elgic Knight is a fighter class. Whoa, that looks awesome. Oh, yeah, no, it's it's a pretty awesome thing. So, that just looks so cool. Um, so the Eldrix Knight is a fighter who uses magic abilities, and I feel like the Twilight would be that, like, epitomize that kind of fighter like someone sure. who's more intelligent and uses mm -hmm. magic as well as their sword it i kind of see them as like this version's um sword mages okay yeah and sword mage for those of you who don't know is a sword user who uses magic also go figure yeah who'd have thought oh uh, no oh this is very bad but, man napa jr jr is ripped yeah oh yeah he is don't fall. Please don't fall. Your health is low. You're falling. You're about to die. Uh, we haven't saved in a while. Yeah, I know. I'm a, I think we're about it to be in a bad, bad place. Well... Or we fell to save us? Uh, no, we're stuck down here. Oh. This is this is one of the problems uh, of this mod is occasionally um, you can fall... Nope! Oh, never mind. We can still get out of here. Oh, sweet. But you may want to wait for your magic. Correct. Or get some potions. Um, you, you have a magic potion. Yeah, no, you're right. There we go. Yeah, there's like, I mean, there's like, there's no reason not to use it. <laughs> it's true. I know you and your anti having full meters. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> for the video, I feel there's nothing wrong with that. Yeah. What's scary is I see two enemy dots, and I'm just yep. waiting for the next one to come huh. down. Uh, oh, you uh, are so lucky. That's as close as it can be. <laughs> no, kill him. Kill him just now. Where am I aiming? No. Oh, Dang it. Also, that's the platforming room. If you notice that pipe for a moment, we have yeah. to skirt the room. Yeah. And there's pushy things. Oh, I noticed. And there's breaks sometimes in the pipe. Yep. I noticed. Uh, Dang it. <laughs> Dang well, it. Well, we're back here. Yep. You. <laughs> ah! <laughs> no! So, this just demonstrates something that I have said for many, many, many years when it comes to RPGs. Okay. Save early, save often. Uh-huh. You know, this time I'm just going to run past them. Really? I don't even care. Ooh. Gutsy. Uh, I don't even care. You don't care? I'm, I don't even care. I'm not weird. All right. What's up, bro? I mean, I'm going to activate this just yeah. so I don't die. Um, yeah. Because the transformation really does help not dying. Oh, yeah. Transformation helps with a lot of things. Like spoilers. Yeah. Man, I really want to watch Bleach now. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's it's a good time. I really like it, obviously. Bro, yeah, you finished it and are keeping up with the manga. Mm-hmm. I got super into it. And then I stopped at about 150. Okay. When they only had 160 episodes. And yeah. just life came in. Yeah. So I had to stop for a bit. Mm hmm And then suddenly the anime is finished. <laughs> <laughs> and there's like 362 episodes. Yeah. Or 366, I can't remember. 
Uh, it's probably a 366. Probably. Yeah. And... And the manga's still ongoing. Yep, the manga's <laughs> still ongoing, so... That's good things. Yeah. But hey, at least we're, you know, wasn't too much stuff we wasted. We got the second key, which was super important. Yep. So that's good. Yeah. And then... Time to run past the next guy. <laughs> yeah. Right, storeroom. Yep. Du, 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 du. I do like sprinting. Sprinting is amazing. I love being able to sprint, especially like being in Khajiit. Mm -hmm. You get to run really fast. Okay. And you got claws. Yeah, that's pretty cool. And then you can jump really high. Mm -hmm. So in Oblivion, yeah. I would not stop jumping until I could jump a house. Nice. And then on the PC, I would just use the tilde, okay, the console, and just uh -huh. make my athletics and everything ridiculously high. Sure. Just so I could jump from, like, one side of the map to the other. <laughs> Alright. Because, you know, that's what you do. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. That's how, uh, that's how you do this. Heck yeah, it is. I feel... <gasps> Uh, you didn't save again, did you? No. Why? Because, like, <laughs> you know, <laughs> you know. You're not dead. I can't. Uh. Okay. Yeah, you know, I accept this as a... Uh, so, how are you going to get across? I'm going to jump on this thing. <laughs> you know what? I don't care. I made it. We're yeah, safe. You made we're it. Good. I was. I seriously thought you were going to die. Oh no, I did too. But you know, this this transformation, very nice, very useful. Dang it! I think we are about to die. Now see, that's cheating. Yeah. <laughs> see, that's that's why I don't like uh, I don't like do enemies the, with yeah, uh, do your with the Fusro Da. No, the Fusro Da is really cheap on enemies. Yeah, and then just... Yep, you know uh, I think that's I the wrong care. way. No, no, that's the right way. You sure? I don't know. Mm, I think it's the wrong way. I could be wrong. I don't I don't know this area. Because I've never been here. I think we're good. Okay. Open yep. it. Open it. Fools Rota! That's one way. Uh, actually, that's the way we're I, supposed yeah, to go. That's the way you're supposed to go. So, yeah, just go down there. Hey, buddy. I, this guy I think we should kill. Yeah. Because otherwise he's just going to yep. mess us up while platforming. Correct. Which is going to not work at all. Exactly. Also, it's going to be a miracle. if Like, we are going to be saving it so much <laughs> trying to platform. <laughs> yeah, as soon as we kill this guy, we should just immediately save. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah, that's the most annoying thing. Yeah. So, yeah, there's a couple things about this mod that I would want to change. Mm -hmm. That being one of them. Uh, your thing is gone. I can see that. Potion of Magicka? Uh, did we have any? Yeah. Alright, cool. So that's going to charge us back up with it. There you go. And boom. Alright, we got him. Now save. Yep. <laughs> Time to save. That's not the save. Nope, that's That's the save. The save. 287. That's yeah. a lot of saves. It is a lot of saves. Alright, so we have two choices. All right. That side? Yep. Or that side? Uh, let's go with the left side. Left side? Yeah. Okay. Have fun! Uh, I mean, that wasn't so hard. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh no. See, this is, <laughs> see, this is when you're, uh... Your silly style of all for nothing uh -huh. really betrays you. <laughs> Correct. Yeah, I. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna put that away. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Uh, I'm gonna try the right. All right, try the right side. I, I think I'm gonna have better success with the right. All right, go for it. Stop. Go. Stop. Uh. Huh. There you go. That was like one of the most difficult parts. Then that happens. No, that going through. 
patience, man. I thought it was fine. Oh no, yeah, you were doing fine. It, uh, it it turns out it wasn't fine. No, it wasn't. But the right side was definitely the best for you. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> so, so. Uh, what the heck? I'm on the edge of the pipe. I'm barely holding on. So, basically, the issue here mm. is Skyrim and mods. Oh, okay, maybe. <laughs> So, like, uh, Skyrim itself is just a buggy game. Sure. And then you add mods to it, and you have no idea what's going to happen. <laughs> it's, uh, it's one of the funnest funnest experiences, though, I'd say. Oh, yeah. So, these ones aren't all in time? I think. Yeah, see, oh, they do, they do a quick they one. They do a quick one after a long one. That was a very long one. <laughs> yeah. No. Crap. Oh, okay, there we go. Um... Uh, I think it's going to do a long one, and then a quick one. Okay. Or this <laughs> or will be the quick one. There it is. That was the quick one. Okay. Oh, or it's completely random. Yeah. <laughs> There's the quick one. Okay. Alright, so it's a long one, then quick one. And We're going to do this. Quick one? Uh... <laughs> uh Oh, they're not in time. Nope. <laughs> nope. It retracted quickly. Uh huh. So that will be one tell, a potential tell, <sighs> or not, or there is no uh, tell and it's completely <laughs> random. <laughs> made it. Made it. Made it. Made it. Made it. Made it. it. Save it. Save it right save now. Saving it right now. <laughs> I was very good. Yeah, it was. Uh... Yeah, you normally don't get uh, platforming that quickly. Yeah, no, that was. It's because I, I spent so long on that. In <laughs> on the past. that one particular one. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so here's the launch pad. Ooh, this will be cool. Now we finally made it to the launch pad. Uh, let's just. Uh, Bunch of levers. Oh, wait, we already have the lift. Yeah. Oh, okay. Don't worry about that. <laughs> I mean, it's really cool, but it, it does have some weird effects, given that this isn't normally how Skyrim works. Yeah. The, yeah. No, this is not how Skyrim works at all. <laughs> but you know, it's pretty cool. Let's get the, let's get this whole thing going on. Oh yeah, I love that. There's like each stone is actually yeah like, etched. Whoa! So there's the ship. That's the ship. Yeah, there's the ship. That's insane. Can you actually like launch the ship and go into space? Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, we can go to planets. I want to go to other planets. Yeah. We need a couple things first, though. All right. Um, we need to get. I think. You know what? We might actually be able to just launch it. I don't... Well, we'll find I, out. I don't remember if we need anything. We'll find out. Yeah. You think I can make it? Uh, no. Okay. You think I can make it? Nope. Think, uh... No. Nope. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's just lava. <laughs> <laughs> that one, definitely not. Uh, that one you might, but I think you'd die from the fall damage. Sure, sure. Your athletics isn't super high. Yeah, this or, game... Or it, whatever it was in this one. The game doesn't have anything like that. You know what I mean, though. There, no, there's there's literally nothing that governs how well you take a fall. Oh. Or, like, this I, one, it's entirely just a base stat. It's like Destiny, where you're safe, you're safe, you're dead. It's I think it's actually determined by race. Oh, okay. So the Khajiit would be awesome. Um, And I have no idea so. about the Saiyans. Right, yeah, no. Like, nope. they could actually take a fall. Maybe. One of these... Is something that takes us up to like a connecting tube. Yeah. Is this it? Possibly. Uh, engineering core. There we go. Also, that's the name of the ship. I'm not even going to attempt to pronounce that. Okay. All right. So here's the engineering core. Okay. So we're inside the ship. Yep. We're inside nice. the ship now. Um. That's probably the main engine. Which way is the cockpit? I. Don't know. I don't have a schematic. Uh, bridge, found it. Or it's just right there. That's awfully convenient. That's a really bad ship design. I mean, if that core engine room goes up, the bridge goes out too. <laughs> Wait. Okay. It was like a hallway to the bridge. Sure. So I guess that's not horrible. Uh, search a chest. Sure. All right. Ooh. There's the Ethereum suit and helmet. Yes. Let's uh, let's let's throw that on. Actually. Oh yeah. Let's do it. Is it better? Oh yeah, it's better. Yeah. Napo Junior Junior is the commander of this ship. 
Whoa, almost fell off. Yeah, you uh, did. Right, so we have these uh, fuel shards. Sweet, we probably need that. Ooh, there's an Archibus. Ooh, uh, what's that? It's a super gun. <gasps> I want it. Um, a launch sequence activator and a lever. Let's... Ooh. Yeah. We might need to put some fuel in the reactor. That that seems like a good idea. Um, We also have way too much... Well, not way too much. We have a little bit too much weight. Yeah, we do have too You know, much we don't weight. need... Probably books. Never mind. Those are all kind of cool. Yeah. What are you... Um, I don't know about that. Uh, Some armor and stuff. Right. Like, since we have the better armor, we yeah. really don't need all that orc stuff. Correct. Well... It actually looks like it's oh it, it's better for us yeah um but that was just better than not wearing anything yeah exactly we probably don't need uh, all the weapons we have though true well they, actually they're all cool yeah oh, we can drop some of this I have like a billion iron why do you have so much iron from uh, level grinding and stuff oh uh, got it uh right fuel yep done to the fuel to the uh, to the thing yep. I like how you have a quest marker. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know what that quest is for. I have um, no idea. It's probably like the, hey, go to... Um, oh, go to that the first area of yeah, the village. Go, go, to, go to, to Whiterun or something. Yeah. No one uh, cares about you, Whiterun. <laughs> We're at a ship. Yeah. We can blow you up. Mm-hmm. I think there's also like a fighter or something in here somewhere. Ooh. Um, I want the fighter. I don't know if we can pilot it. Ah, uh, just well, like what happens with it. Yeah, but it looks cool. Yeah, it does. Uh, for en engine control. Uh, engineer's nuts. All right, that's a lot of words. That's a lot of words. I'm gonna throw a fuel in something and see if it works. Nope, nope, didn't do anything. Nope. Okay. What about now? Nope. Okay. All right, maybe we do need to read the engineer's notes. Uh. <laughs> it's super, it's, I really like this mod for the amount of depth and lore that everything gets in it. Yeah. Um, but it takes way too much time. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty much. Like, something I really like is to just take a character and really run them through this and spend really a whole lot of time with it and being like, okay, I'm going to read every note and talk about it all and be like, yeah. yeah, I got this. Well, we could do that, like, off screen. Sure. And then on the next episode, like, actually go through it now that we know mm -hmm. what we're doing. Also, there's a bunch of chests in here. That are all empty. Yeah. That's probably so, where all the fuel was or something. Probably. Um, da, da, da. That's not a door. Okay. Well. All right. Watch, there's one chest that has the one thing you need. Fuel shard. Hey, now we got two. Because, like, there's a left one and yeah, a right yeah. one. Yeah, Absolutely. Um, I mean, I don't know. It's like they planned it. It's almost like they planned it. <laughs> da, 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 da. Run in as fast as I can. It's bum, not bum, that bum, super bum, fast. Bum. Da, da, no. da, da, da. I mean, despite being a Saiyan, we're not the fastest one. Correct. Or the smartest. Yep. But man, do we have the best transformation? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Ain't no saying got that kind of thing. <laughs> uh, oh, there was another thing. Engineer's notes. Are you going to be... Yep. Not super long. True. I'm going to put the launch sequence. I don't think it did it. I don't think so. Uh, oh, there's things down there. There are. Let's try that. Maybe you should get rid of the launch sequence right. first. <laughs> so it's not all of a sudden <laughs> like, hey, guess what? S fire off into space. Yeah. While not being seated or something. Also, I probably should have been seated before I pulled that lever. Probably. Uh, a bunch of levers. Wow. Okay. I wonder if they'll do something. You know, I don't honestly know. And there's buttons. That would be ridiculous if every single <laughs> one did something. I mean, I imagine in the lore it does. Valve. I don't know if that does anything. Probably not. But it looks awesome. Yeah, it does. Because, like, you know, you just come over here, you flip these uh, flip these levers and be like, all right, so we've got... To, well, I can't reach that one. No. But, uh, you know, you come over here, you reach, flip some levers and be like, all right, yeah, we get those systems up to go and push some buttons. 
Yeah, like each person has like their own seat. Like it's done very well. Yeah. You know, you you, you turn some valves, push <laughs> a button. Not that button though. Nope, not that one. That's the so, one button. <laughs> um. Yeah. You come over here. You flip some levers. Yeah. We. Yeah. You, yeah. It's a good time. It's really cool. It's a good time. Uh, really, though, I forget where to put the fuel. Alright. Well, Just, we yep. can do that off-screen and then come back next episode. Okay. But the important thing is, we are now the captain of the ship. Absolutely. Nappa Jr. Jr. is all that reigns supreme. Ah, uh, yeah. So we will see you all next time. Probably not in Skyrim for like another month and a half. But we will come back. Awesome. See y'all later. Bye.